what is up everyone welcome and welcome back to my channel so as you can see my hair it is pretty it's braided it's straight y'all we about to cut some inches my nails we gonna cut some inches so i'm gonna sit y'all down so that way y'all can see how long we are and then we gonna cut it I'm sorry, my ring light is broke. I have to get another one. And I'm gonna bring my light in soon so that way y'all can see what we're gonna do today. But, lamp check real quick. Alright y'all, so we back, my hair is out, it's been out since that last clip that y'all seen, but y'all didn't see the clip, y'all didn't see the snip snip, okay, I got my hair cut, okay, so I went in, listen, just hear me out, just hear me out, before I show you, just hear me out, okay, I went in there with the strongest intention to get my hair trimmed, okay, but y'all know i like my nice blunt even cuts so blunt cuts is easier to see if your hair is uneven if it's thin in some areas so so i told y'all before probably like a few months ago that something weird was happening with my hair i don't know if it's just breaking off at the ends or if it's getting snagged on something but the bottoms of my hair probably about two three inches of hair at the bottom at the very bottom they were thinning out and y'all know what blunt cuts, if you have it like thick up at the top, like here, and then thin at the bottom, like, it gotta go. It gotta go, okay? It gotta go. So, <laughs> so, so, this intention of a trim turned out to be a little cut, a little snippy snip, just a little higher. Honestly, I love the length. Because I've been wanting to cut my hair for a while. I've been trying to get to a bob. But bobbing with short hair and it's going to turn into a fro. That was like a no. So I couldn't do that. I don't know if I want to show y'all my my hair first. Or if I want to show y'all how much came off. Because it's like a good, like a good amount. I don't know. <laughs> like it looks. Okay so hear me out. It's kind of frizzy because I've been working out in it. It's not like as sleeky straight as my hair would normally be in a silk press. But it's kind of frizzy. I've been working out. I've sweated in it. It kind of like drawed up a little bit. I put it in braids. It kind of got crinkled. And I worked out today right before I got a cut. So back to, <laughs> back to frizz. But this is about a good five six inches off my hair y'all that's good five six inches we ain't waist length no more we not <laughs> oh god let me see we not waist length anymore we not hip length we not hip length we not mid butt cheek length like no that is over and i'm I, i'm okay with that so it's still long but i'm just gonna go ahead and i'm gonna go ahead and show y'all okay i'm gonna show y'all <gasps> See, it's nice and thick. I don't have to 
worry about getting caught in the doors, getting caught in the car door. I don't have to worry about my hair getting caught in the freaking car wash vacuum clean dryer thing, vacuum cleaner thing. When you go to clean your seats at the car wash, it gets stuck in the crevice. I don't have to worry about it touching the car seat. I don't have to worry about it getting stuck in my jeans or in my hoodie or putting my hair up when I need to go to the bathroom. I don't have to do any of that anymore. Having my hair straight this last time really put it into perspective that as much as I love to have long hair, I don't think I would ever want to have that long of a hair anymore. One, because don't get me wrong, like I said, I do love long hair. That's always been my goal to have. But once you reach like a certain point of length, okay, once you reach that point, and I reached that point probably like the last time I straightened my hair and I just didn't get around to cutting it like I really wanted to. But once you reach that point, it's like it's like you can't really enjoy the length of your hair because you're always putting it up. Mind you, I straightened my hair right before my birthday. My birthday is August 22nd. I straightened it, I think, August 20th. It's been straight. It is now... It's now September 26th. Been straight for a good over a month and some days, but probably of that month and days, I probably have my hair up 30 days out of the whole what? 36, 37, 38 days that I had it straight. One that is because every time I go to sit down, my hair down, my hair is getting stuck. When I sit down, I can't do my head forward like that because I'm sitting and pulling on my hair, breaking it off even more. So I literally would have to put my hair up in a bun because it is just, it was too much. And I never honestly thought I would be saying that. I just wanted to bring y'all a quick update, this quick length check to let y'all know that we back. So on that note, if you're not subscribed already, welcome. My name is Mara. We like to grow healthy, natural hair on this channel from mid butt cheek length back up into lower mid back. Is that mid back? I don't know what area that is. Y'all got the idea. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe. Hit that thumbs up button. If you like this video, please don't be mad at me and hit that thumbs down because it'll go back. It's just hair. And y'all can, again, continue on this journey with me. Also, be sure to share this video. And I will see you guys in the next one.